Drop-in daycare programs are popular at places like the gym, but it's virtually unheard of at hospitals. A local mom is working to change that, and she's getting some national attention for a program she started right here. Quinn Local 6 reporter Amy Frazier checks in on My Little Waiting Room. This is a great idea. Yeah, it is. As a breast cancer survivor, Amy Patterson knows what it's like to try and care for yourself and a toddler and make it to all these medical appointments. Amy had family there to help, but she knows not everyone is that lucky, so she started a program she now hopes will one day be in hospitals across the country. Inside my little waiting room at Providence St. Vincent Medical Center. Show them what else we have in there. Three-year-old Connor has lots to keep him busy, and that's a huge relief to his mom. It's one less thing you have to think about when you're not feeling well. Lori Miller had a heart attack last fall and has medical appointments here several times a month. It's just so nice. Sometimes I get a call at the last second. You got, you know, you, you need to come in. We have an appointment for you right now. What do I do with a three-year-old? My little waiting room was born out of another mom's scramble for child care. My name is Amy Patterson. I'm a breast cancer survivor. Featured in this video by L'Oreal, Amy Patterson found herself fighting breast cancer with a toddler in tow. And throughout that year of treatment, she realized she had 144 medical visits. On their Monday walks together, Melissa Moore and her friend Amy had an idea. We thought, you know, gyms, movie theaters, retail stores like Ikea, they all have drop-in childcare, so why isn't it the hospital? Since starting the nonprofit two and a half years ago, the fully licensed facility staffed by Volunteers of America has served thousands of children. Melissa says it's been amazing to see Amy turn the darkness of cancer into a ray of light for other families. So that children can thrive while families heal. Nominated by Melissa, Amy has been named one of L'Oreal's 2012 Women of Worth, earning a $10,000 grant for My Little Waiting Room. Ooh, they do match. The program here is working so well. The dream now is to expand it to hospitals across the country. We want there to be drop-in child care at every hospital, just like there is a pharmacy or a gift shop. Using this site as a model. Oh, it's been so helpful. The co-founders are putting together a special toolkit to share with anyone interested in starting a similar program. A second My Little Waiting Room will also be open at Providence Portland Medical Center this spring. Spring. Now, of the 10 honorees chosen from all across the country, L'Oreal will award one woman of worth an additional $25,000 for her charity. You can vote for Portland's Amy Patterson online through tomorrow. We've put a link to do that on our website at coinlocal6.com. Reporting for you, Amy Frazier, CoinLocal6. What a great service. Okay, thanks, Amy.